military as well. Esto se llama el oro negro. El haitiano es oro negro en Dajabón. Yo pongo 30 haitianos, le quito los asientos, uno arriba de otro. ¿Me entiendo? En los chequeos, el chofer, yo soy el copiloto, yo bajo, comando, tengo 20 gente a 500, son 10 mil pesos. ¿Me entiendes? Sí, Por cada sí. chequeo. Este es el negocio que deja más dinero. Los coroneles llegan aquí y se hacen multimillonarios. Porque el coronel, el coronel, el coronel tiene su, su bartender, sus oficiales menores, que ellos dejan pasar por dinero a los haitianos. Lo dejan pasar por dinero, por mil pesos. Cada haitiano pasa por mil pesos en el puente. Other sources have also told us about corruption. Coronel Adamis denies the allegations in response to our written inquiry. They were invented by human traffickers to harm the authorities. The president has ordered the deportations by decree. He was not available for an interview. The deportations seem contradictory because without Haitians, the construction, agriculture, and tourism industries cannot function. How many were penned up in cars remains uncertain. Some, however, managed to escape again right away. But most must return to Haiti, across the bridge. Considering their hardship, the UN demands that no more Haitians be deported. But the USA are ignoring this as well. So, when the bus arrives, we will see what the gens are doing. So, there are two bus that arrive here, so we will receive the migrants. Michelot Difficile, from the International Organization for Migration, the IOM, is looking after the deportees on the Haitian side, especially children who are sometimes sent away without their parents. According to the IOM, human rights violations are regular occurrences. Many of those affected report abuse. Almost 100% of Haitians are of African descent, originating from the French slave trade. Women with children tend to be sent away more frequently. The deportees stranded at the IOM are given a meal, a place to sleep if needed, money for food, and a bus ticket for their journeys back to their villages in Haiti. Living pas être en crise parce que yo voye un pil moun vini et moun yo témoigne yo rentre pran yo la kayo yo pran yo nan la rue yo pran yo nan chantier pendant yap travay donc yo voye tout type de moun vini et yo pran yo n'importe qui côté pour yo voye yo vini. <laughs>